let's see what Semantic Scholar is all about. A free AI-powered research tool for scientific literature. It sounds like something we need. Here's a product overview. Let's see if we can find some more information. Experience a smarter way to search and discover research. Find relevant research. Scan papers faster. Check highly influential citations. It's also important. Cite any paper. Also important. Manage your papers in one space with a library. Research feeds, personalized AI-powered paper recommendations that can also be useful. Get new, notified of new papers or citations. And check all your research updates on a dashboard. Let's see, try other exciting research tools. Semantic Reader, Semantic Scholar, Academic Graph API, Semantic Scholar Open Research Corpus. So one can even go and check I don't know if these are going to be helpful to you as well. Very nice. Let's see how it works. I've already created an account and logged in. It's completely free. And let's type something into the search bar. Cricket injury. And here we go. It gives quite a few options. Paper has an available PDF, save alert, you can cite. Again, you can access the PDF here. It shows us the references and it shows us related papers. Now that is super useful because it will help us find more research in this area. Here we go. References and related papers. We can create an alert, which means that we'll receive an alert whenever this paper receives a new citation, which is also useful because then it helps us pick up new research in this area. Or we can save the papers, paper in one of our folders. I can definitely see how Semantic Scholar can help us organize our research much better. If you found this video helpful, smash the like button. For more useful tips to boost your research experience, subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscribe button below this video. And while you're at it, hit the bell so that you get notified whenever I produce a new video. If you need a solution to a challenge not yet covered on my channel, leave a comment in the box below. See you in the next video.